And we are back here in Pewter City. I've trained everybody up to level 13 except for Polywag, who's still at 12 because I figured I'd just show this last battle on screen so we can uh, get Water Gun out of it. The only other moveset change so far was Venonat gaining Supersonic, which is pretty helpful, I guess. It's not the best accuracy, but at least it's something more than Tackle. However, I was thinking of giving it a little bit of extra oomph as well. I uh, checked everybody's hidden power types. Anyway, there we go with Water Gun. Anyway, yeah, I checked everybody's hidden power types. Poliwag gets Grass. Uh, not that interesting, really, because Grass covers a lot of the things that Water does. Mankey gets Rock, which is pretty useful, but I'm thinking of adding on a team member pretty soon that'll be having a Rock move anyway. Aisha gets Bug, which Venonat is going to be learning eventually, but Venonat gets Steel, which is not really that good of a type, but it's not going to be getting any decent moves for a while, and I should be able to be uh, get more Hidden Power TMs later. So I'm going to go ahead and give it this. At least it'll give it some usefulness. And I'm just going to go ahead and take the long route to get to Brock. I see no reason not to enjoy the sights. Oh ho! This totally wasn't planned at all. Yeah, I, I did a lot of walking around to get Togepi. Uh, I'm not going to be using this Togepi because I don't really feel like it. Uh, I used Togetic on other runs. Anyway, uh, uh, Brock. Kind of a difficulty in this, actually. Uh, not too crazy about Poliwag missing HP there, but eh, whatever. I've got some Oran Berries that um, Zigzagon picked up, so I'll just use one of those. I don't remember what he leads with, but Poliwag seems like a good place to start. So, let's just start out and see how this goes. Uh, I don't know if you can hear the music here. It's not the normal gym leader music. I think this is either like Elite Four from Hoenn or something, I'm not sure. So anyway, he's got his standard Geodude, but as you saw, he actually had six Pokemon instead of the usual two. So that can be kind of a butt if you're not prepared for it. Luckily, without me really planning to do so, I happen to be packing a ton of super effective moves against Rock types. So, hopefully this will go a lot better than it did when I fought him on Jordan's game. Ah, crap. Okay, got that one. Oh, I'm not using the Sunkern. It probably would have come in handy against the Kabuto, but... I thought about it, I really don't want to be using Sunkern. It's too useless. Evolving it early on would help a little bit, but it's still not really that interesting to me. Someone posted that I'll be able to get Cacnea on Route 11. That's not too late, so... I think I'm going to use that. Okay, Poliwag. Poliwag levels up a lot quicker than most other things. Ammonite. I'll go with the Mankey again. Vulpix, of course, being a reference to Brock in the anime. And are we going to survive this? No. Let's... See how this will work with the hidden power. I don't think I think steel is bad against water, but we got to get Venonat in here somewhere, and we'll see if that works out. Oh God, Rock Tomb. Okay, I'm very glad that missed. Let's disable that. I'm surprised that Rock Tomb. I mean, that disable was actually helpful for once. I might actually be getting some use out of that move. Yeah, it's not doing too much, but it works. Ah, screw you. Okay, then, oh, it's got Rock Tomb back, but, let's see, it'll either protect and block me, or it'll use Rock Tomb, but I'll hit first, so I'm just going to go for the tackle. Oh, there's always that option. Crud. Um, let's just confuse you again. Hey. Alright, sure. Switch out for that. Let's go for you.
Stupid rock jam. Ah, crunch berries. Polywag, you're gonna end up sweeping this guy, aren't you? Okay, back to the stupid Omanite. Uh, it might actually be useful to put that thing to sleep first, but... Yeah, I, I m better do that. Ah, crud. Oh, that didn't do much, though. Stop with the protect crap. Oh my god, come on. Oh, you suck. Come on, actually hit this time when you use it. Oh. This isn't working well. Oh, okay, he's stupid. I'm lucky that I have uh, water absorb on this. Come on. Finally! It only took a month. Okay, let's see if we can actually whittle this thing down now. Uh, I'll hit it once, then I'll confuse it while it's asleep. So when it wakes up, it'll still be confused, I hope. Unless it snaps out of confusion, too. I don't know. I'm not sure how that works. If you're not actually attacking, I'm not sure if the confusion counter is really going down or not. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, Venonat, you took that like a beast. Okay, let's disable Rock to him for good measure, or not. This Omanite is definitely being more annoying than I would have expected. Really needed that. Come on. Oh, he's got a lemonade too. Come on, you're not supposed to be doing this. Am I actually going to be able to beat this thing? Probably not. Oh my god. Come on. I can just whittle it down. I should be able to take one more of those. Speed's dropping like crazy, though. That's kind of a big problem. Come on. Isn't Rock Tomb, like, pretty low accuracy? Why does it hit every time? Come on. Don't miss. Oh, you suck. Come on. There we go. Now I gotta get in a free healing turn. Onyx shouldn't be a problem, but I definitely need to get rid of that speed loss. And I need to heal, so... Going for the death fodder here. I don't think I actually bought any of these potions. I just found them all. Oh. Okay, then. Do I have anything else I want to use on it? As it's... Nah, it's fine. I'll just take the hit. And I should outspeed it, I think. I'm not entirely sure. Ooh. Okay. But yeah, Onyx has pretty bad attack. And that put it out of healing range. Swagger, seriously? Am I gonna have to switch in Togepi as more death fodder here? I think I am. Except that's not really gonna help, but at least it'll get rid of the confusion. Okay, it did help, because it dug. I'm getting very lucky in this battle. Well, and unlucky, but... Yeah, this is going to be a close one. Will Water Gun actually finish it off? I don't remember how much it did last time. I could put it to sleep first, but eh. Okay, good. Yeah, that was a doozy. That was actually much, much harder than I was expecting. Whew. Okay, um... What's that? Is that Rock Tomb? Yeah, don't think I'm going to be using that. So anyway, I guess that pretty much took up a segment on its own, surprisingly. I figured I'd be able to move on. But anyway, putting away Togepi. And I guess this is what I'll be taking to Mount Moon. I want to have an open spot. or No, I'll be backtracking anyway. But yeah, I don't plan on taking anything else with. Sunkern, you're not going to be coming with. 
So I guess that's it. Uh, off screen, I'll probably buy more Pokeballs, catch the stuff around here, and then next time we'll move on to Route 3. See you then.